Alrighty folks, a very warm welcome to you. My name is Nick, and on ZX Spectrum 48K, I'm looking at a bit of a homebrew here, written in BASIC, yes. It's been it's Princess Rescue, uh, published by Radical Computer Company in 2021, and it was part of a competition, the Byte Maniacs Concurso Competition BASIC 2022, or Byte Maniacs Concurso BASIC 2022, that's what it was called, I believe. Anyway, so it's in BASIC, so I'm expecting the response of the key to be a little bit slow. Uh, you take control of some guy, must collect a key on each screen, then rescue the princess. Look, the princess is in the top right there, I can see, and there's a red door. The top left there seems to be a green key. I'm that character there, and I've just fallen off and died. Right, now this, yeah, this is this is going to be a bit awkward, folks. A game written in BASIC without any compilers. Now, cue to go up the ladder. Uh, now, I hope this game doesn't frustrate me too much. Um, yes, here we go. Wednesdays are typically... Hmm, can I fall, jump across? Oh, well, he's dead. No, he's alive, right. Now, Wednesday typically to, tend to be a mod or a uh, homebrew sort of like uh, affair. Some are pretty cool in an AGD and very advanced. Some are very basic, a bit like this. But that's all the fun of the ZX Spectrum. I'm not sure if this won the competition. Uh, the only other game we reviewed from this competition is Arkanoid Back to Basic. So have a look at that as well. Right, okay. So I've got the key, now I just need to jump up here, I've jumped up there, right that's level 1 done. Top right you see my amount of lives is 3, that's level 1, on to level 2. Right, it's drawing that, it draws it fairly quickly for basic, anyway that jumping's going to take a bit, bit of getting used to, it doesn't seem to be the same length of jump each time. Um, I'm on keyboard, I'm trying to moderate this, this time I press the M button and O and P to see if that makes a difference to the jump, it doesn't seem to. Uh, avoid getting hit by any of these maniac sort of things. I like that the the character is quite small, a bit like the size of Load Runner game, which wasn't in basic. Load Runner is a good game. I suppose that's the closest that this is to is Load Runner. Now, Princess in the top left here, in the and the door. You can see the key there, just underneath them in green. Right, there's time. There's red. Here we go. How far am I going to get into this game? I do not know. If you've completed it, wee, if you completed it, let me know. You can drop as far down as you need to. Can't seem to break into the program. They've sorted that out. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Right, okay. There's no timer here, so you can take as long as you want to. I'm not sure if the um, the colours of the, the uh, sort of like screens will change at some point. Whoops. Right, okay. Just be careful. Be careful. Just got to get across that other side. Oh no! Uh, oh god, I'm starting to get annoyed already. I'm getting annoyed already. This jumping is the most imprecise thing I've ever seen. Oh god, right, hang on a minute, right. Go. Oh, hell's bells, hell's teeth. If you want to download this, uh, see if it's as frustrating for you as it is for me. Uh, it's Princess Rescue. You can get it from Spectrum Computing, I think. So do a search of there and you'll probably find it. Come out in 2021, it says here. But then why is it a part of the competition of 2022? I don't know. Maybe there was an overlap. But it came out in 2021. According to my notes, my notes are never wrong, are they? Well, sometimes. Good. Alright, uh, dibby It's basic. Put your favourite basic game below. Mine is probably Through the Wall, the first one I ever played on the Horizons take which come with the ZX Spectrum. Uh, Wu Dang, that's a good one to look at. It's one of those games where you can't um, believe it's been programmed in BASIC, but apparently it has. I still struggle to believe it, but check out Wu Dang, W-U-D-A-N-G. Check out that review as well if you haven't already. Right, across. Doing a little bit better here. Come on, let's get off level two. Oh, smells. This is a PG friendly channel, so I'll never swear. I might say zippity doodah or something. Now, if you want to see some other ZX Spectrum um, games, uh, we've got a whole, uh, we've got over a thousand now. Uh, yes, that's right, over a thousand, uh, just. At time of recording, so have a look at the playlist to get there. Click on my username, then the playlist tab on the channel page, and then that'll get you there. Now, I'm saying swear, swear ones in my, in my mind. A big thank you to the subscribers. If you've watched this far into the video and haven't subscribed already, please consider doing so because that helps the channel continue and grow because there's lots of new channels growing all the time and if they overtake me, well, that makes me, uh, well, less visible, which is very tricky. And believe me, there are channels growing every day that buy subs and likes and stuff and then it makes it very hard to get noticed even now. I know what tune this is. It's quite nice music. Do, 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 do. Do 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 do. If you know this tune, let me know. As I doodly do do, doodly do do. I think I'll listen to this for a bit. 
It's a nice, it's a nice, fun one. So I'm not sure, I'm not sure what other games, uh, game won this particular competition. There's about five or six in it. As I say, we reviewed Arkanoid Back to Basic, which is a little bit slower than normal Ar Arkanoid. That's sort of like a, a breakout clone uh, there for you to uh, get used to. So essentially, you've got Q is up. I think A might go down, although it doesn't say if you're actually physically on the ladder. O is left, P is right, and then the combination of M with any of those will do the jump. Doesn't seem to change the uh, the length of the jump in the sort of like direction, and they're the only sort of like graphics there are available uh, there. Yes, I think it's done the whole tune now, isn't it? Really? So to open the door, use the key to get through. You know this, and then beware of the guardians who are dotted all around the place. Right? Okay, that's enough music. Let's see if I can get off level two. Well, let's see if I can get off level one, really. So for basic, it is moving quite a lot of stuff. The graphics is quite small. Uh, a good choice of uh, colours for this one. Uh, up the small ladder. Right, come on, let's just speed this. Boob. So if you hit the ceiling, you will just fall down straight like that. But as I say, you can drop as far as you possibly want. There's the princess looking pretty as ever in the top right in Cyan behind the green door. Green door. Shaking Stevens. Yes, if you got that reference, then hooray for you. As I try and... Oh, okay. I, I feel like a drunk fly buzzing around the room here uh, on this screen of this game. Uh, better homebrews are available, but it's interesting to see what people can do in basic. So, you know, if, if you've got some books about basic or skills, you could be making a game like this. But, um, yeah, without a compiler, they always run quite a bit uh, slower and draw each thing uh, separately, as it's doing here. So you might see all the uh, all the things on the screen moving uh, one after the other. I mean, they haven't done a, a bad job considering. Boof, right. Oh man, right, okay, so, just got to get this jump and then we're cooking on gas, there we go, so that's stage one done, that's how you do it in this town. Beep. This won't be a complete walkthrough, this is never expert gameplay, dodgy gameplay, nincompoot chat, or nincompoot chat and dodgy gameplay, seeing how you would have got on, on the game on your first or second go. And this is pretty much my first go, first go away, right up the ladder we go, beep beep beep. Oh man, so you did a huge jump there. I think you need to be right on the end of that one to have any chance of actually getting there. Right, okay. Or do we just jump over that thing? Jump over, oh no. Oh. I'm not enjoying myself, folks. It's not a game I wanna go back and play again. Maybe it's the basicness of the programming, but the, the jumping is just, for me, it's just, it's, it's I like games that are a bit of a stress bust, and this is causing a little bit of stress for me, but uh, don't let it stress you. I'm playing the game so you don't have to, but you might be better at it. Uh, if you play it and you're better at it, you've got some tips, then well done. I'm doing the same basic things. So essentially, the, um, the level's going to get gradually more uh, technical as you go through, gradually more difficult. First level was pretty much a standard one. It's trying to get used to how the man jumps, what sort of distance yeah, what sort of distance he does compared. I think it's probably the distance away he is from the ledge depends on how far he will maximum jump, and it's cut short depending on what stuff you're near to. That's never going to work, is it? De -de -de -de. I, I'm so determined to turn this off at the moment. I was, I was hoping for a little, something a little bit more um, user-friendly, but, you know, that's the thing with basic games. Right, I think I got it that time. Right, now we're in the middle. We need to get the key to the left, and they probably have to drop down and do the whole thing again to get down the right-hand side and travel across the top. Oh, I think the princess could probably rescue herself from here. Right, get ready to bend your knees. Oh, I've done that bit. Can I go down? No, I can't go down. I thought I could go down the ladder, but once you're up the top, you can't do. Bib, bib, bib. Uh, I'd like to see the programming of this, but I can like, guess it a little bit, what it would look like. That's enough, good. Right, it should be plain sailing now, he says, if you can get controlling of the uh, jumping here. But for a basic game, it's a, it's, a, it's a good job, really. Right, little jumps, little jumps. Don't, don't fall all the way down to the bottom. Don't fall down to the bottom, or I will not be happy. Right, this is... Okay! Game over! Game over, big nose. Well, yes. Do, 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 do. Now, it goes against my better judgement here, but I want to give the game the fullest chance as I possibly can, so this will definitely, effortly, effortly be my last go. Maybe that means it is addictive then, after all, but yes. So, I should be able to race through stage one, yeah? With everything I've learned. Might cut this short if it all goes a bit pants, you know, or goes a bit wrong. Biff, 
Right, come on, come on. I don't know who this guy's name is. I don't think there's a backstory here, just that you've got to rescue a princess who for some reason has got her... Oh, man, has somehow got herself trapped in this nightmare. I can't get on that yellow bit there. If I could do that, would be great. Oh, mad drunk fly stroke ant. If you are a mad stroke fly type of ant thing, then comment below. Is this quite representative of your day? Right, don't do that same mistake again, that's for sure. Right. There we go, jump! Holy! Ah, ah, ah. Sorry, I'm just going mad now. Um, I'm going to rip my hair out, but I can't afford to rip my hair out because I'm just trying to hang on to it as best I can. Uh, I've got a receding hairline, but it's still there. Uh, maybe I need a hair transplant and fillers on the face. Right, okay. Biff, boff. Come on, little man. Don't fall to. Oh! Are you as frustrated as I am? I just... This bloke needs a jetpack for Christmas. For Christmas, get this guy, get this guy a jetpack. Right, this is it. I'm not going to do all four lives. If I don't do it now, I'm I'm going. I'm going, and I'm going to sit in a dark room for a little bit and calm myself down. Yes. Right, that's stage one done. Hooray for us! You rescued the princess. Well, I hope she's grateful. Oh look, she's got herself captured again. The woman's a nincompoop. A nincompoop, hun. I, know, I, know, I can't rescue her every day. If she's gonna get, if she's gonna get captured every every, every single hour, I, I I think they can probably keep her. Right, stage two. This is the fairly easy bit. He says. Right, that's the key done. Now we just need to get to that green door. Green door. I've gone mad. What do you mean gone mad? I went mad years ago. Right. Right. Yes. Up we go here. 1,000 ZX Spectrum games reviewed. Hooray for us. Right, uh, now. No, that's it. That's it. I, I, I'm, I'm, I'm doing a tantrum. Right, that's it. I'm not playing this anymore. So, hope you liked having a look at that. Very frustrating game because of the jumping, but it's probably because it's had to be programmed in basic. It looks okay. You might be able to get the control of it, but I, I won't in case I start chopping off my own head in frustration. So, hope you liked having a look at that one. That was Princess Rescue on the ZX Spectrum 48K, published by Radical Computer Company in 2021, and it was pretty radical. Um, if you've got any comments about this game, similar games, or anything retro, or in Indeed homebrew, then uh, put that below. You're more than welcome. Until next time, take great care of yourself and a very fond goodbye. Goodbye.